the store today. Thanks so much, Susan. You bought a ton of stuff from us. It is heading actually to Canada. Mm -hmm. So thank you so much for the support. We much appreciate it. If you want deals on deals right now, we are doing it in our eBay store. I wouldn't say that we're downsizing our eBay store because that's not true. Basically, we're trying to just sell a lot of stuff for like reasonably priced, almost like we were doing whatnot, like whatnot prices, mm -hmm. just to get it out of here so we can raise our um, sale price per item. Like right now, we have some 10, five to ten dollar items we're gonna show you, and we're trying to get into that really like. 15 to 35 range mm -hmm. we really like to be over 25 like that would be really good 25 plus shipping which that one day hopefully will be that high but we're just trying to liquidate some stuff so let's go over some stuff real quick we still like the stuff that's easy to list and easy to ship but 17 dollars for a new beetle repair manual these are always good and they usually sell for 15 or 20 bucks we have a tool that's sold this is a craftsman lineman small Lyman pliers went for $10. We got a iPhone 6 Plus that just went for parts for $16 plus shipping. We got Snap-on Air Drill, $35 plus shipping. They went down in prices a lot because a lot of people were switching to batteries. So when you're buying those out and about uh, at a yard sale or something, kind of got to get them for a good price unless they're a newer model. That's an older model. If they're a newer model, they're probably still going to go for over 100 bucks. But if they're an older model, just make sure you get it for super cheap. Then we got a Harley Davidson 100th year anniversary carpet bag, duffel bag here, $120 plus shipping. We had a golf club sale. It's a hybrid, so for $39, it looks like a golf club. Golf clubs, after you've like seen one sell for 30 bucks, I feel like you've seen them all. So I'll show different ones. If they're like super different because we had a chipper and a wedge sale each one of those sold for 15 bucks the scotty cameron sold sold it for cheap um because it had a hole in it right here but we only picked it up for 50 cents and it went for 25 dollars plus shipping you had a lot of barclay lead farm animals from the 40s so for 45 dollars plus shipping that came out of a storage unit from like six months ago that might have been the best storage unit we've ever done. Mm -hmm. uh, the amount of money we made in just these small Barclay lead figures were thousands of bucks, right? Mm -hmm. So that is on the Bearded Thrift Machine channel. It is a great storage unit to watch because it's just it just keeps coming. It's like mm -hmm. every box we open is full of like amazing old stuff. Right here, propane extension, $10 plus shipping. We had some nut drivers right here, so $25 plus shipping. Inside this box is three vintage blue, but it's a blue ball mason jar, $20 plus shipping. Uh, the rod redales, rod deals, whatever you want to call it. These are the skates I picked up at the Goodwill not too long ago, and we picked them up for this. That actually goes inside, but we picked them up for um, it was like 15 an offer at 120 plus shipping. So $15 into 120 is not bad, and the lights are off. Then this smell always sells for Scentsy. It is called Tomato Vine. We've had Tomato Vine multiple times and it sells all the time for about seven bucks. This is a Tomato Vine and Woodland Suede. They sell for $14 plus shipping. The top or the uh, spool of a Mitchell right in fishing reel right here in front of me with the case. This is in a, uh, in a tackle box that I think you bought or I bought. I forget for like five bucks. Got the whole tackle box for five bucks, and this one thing sold for ten dollars plus shipping. And then the new wave dome extender sold fifteen dollars plus shipping. Now, I do want to go over some sales we had, uh, what yesterday or two days ago. We didn't have the camera with us, but we had some. I'll go over just the big ones because we had some monster sales. When you're out there, look for this stuff. Uh, we had a cool little boat sale, the Balsam boats from Reeves that sold for twenty two dollars plus shipping. Then we had we had all the Duluth stuff sell. All those Duluth shirts you saw at the Bearded Thrift Machine channel we picked up. They all sold for $85 plus shipping. We had some USS Saratoga picture sell, $60 plus shipping. A Callaway Golf Club sell for $75 plus shipping. Your Goofy hat sold, $15.50 plus shipping. Johnny O shirt, $23 plus shipping. The Dolly Parton nightlight you picked up, $9 mm -hmm. plus shipping. We had a Finn Noir Ahab, 16 fishing reel new in box but open box sell three hundred and five dollars that's been our biggest sale probably in a while right mm -hmm. so that was pretty good and we had some more johnny o stuff sell so and then we that was it so that's not too bad uh sales are still cranking out we're doing more than what we usually do in sales and honestly we haven't listed in like three days and all we're doing is we wake up first thing in the morning i i stop and i uh sell similar 
and then we do that throughout the day and we've been doing 50 or 60 of those a day in our sales we're getting rid of stuff we're lowering prices we're doing background uh different backgrounds if you didn't know if you guys had because this was like a game changer we learned it on cats the nurse flipper show the other night uh punching and picking picking and punching rod who's the co-host there told us about this so if you have the app photo room you have to pay for it though, like per year, I think it's like 60 bucks or something like that. It's well worth the money. We're not sponsored by them or anything, but I'm just telling you, they are well worth the money when it comes to that. But if you do one picture and then you do like, uh, you take a picture and then you remove the background, it does an instant background that you can click. And then once you do that, it gives you like awesome backgrounds. I'll throw up some pictures that we've done with these backgrounds and it takes away the white background and puts in like this really nice Photoshop background. So it might be something you want to look at to us for our higher end stuff. We're going to see if it works. Uh, so it, ha it hasn't worked yet. I think we've only done like five though with that instant background. But Photo Room, if you haven't been using that, I'll tell you what, it can lighten your pictures, it can uh, give you a white background, it can give you a fake awesome looking background. We put uh, Willow on the beach the other day just by taking a picture, removing the background, putting her on the beach, it was so fun. So it's a good app, I don't know if anybody else uses it, but we use it all the time, it's well worth the money. So uh, we're gonna go home, pack this stuff up.